What's up guys? In this video I'm going to be reviewing the Arrowhead stand and this stand is very awesome. It's compatible with a ton of different tablets. So this will work with your iPad 1, iPad 2, your HP touchpad, just about any tablet you may have. And if you're interested in purchasing one of these, you can head over to griffintechnology.com and you can pick one of these up for a little under 20 bucks. And in this video I'm going to be using my iPad 2 to show you guys the cool features of the stand itself. One thing I want to point out is you cannot charge your device in portrait mode, but as you can see here, you can charge it in landscape mode. So as you can see, the base of the feet, so the underneath and the bottom part, they're actually pretty thick and they're pretty big, so it's not going to be able to tip over and it won't fall over when you're actually using the device. So when you push it like this, it's not just going to tip over when you're playing games or anything like that. So that's very nice to know that it's not going to tip over and break on you. It's actually really easy to switch the orientation of your device. So in my case, I'm going from landscape to portrait. Just go ahead and pick up the device, and then you can go ahead and sit it right back down on the feet there. Then we can go ahead and switch it back to landscape here. And as I mentioned earlier, you are going to be able to charge your device in landscape mode, as I'm doing right here, but you're not going to be able to do it in portrait mode. So as you can see, I'm doing it fine just here, but if I would like to put it in portrait mode, the USB cable is just going to get bunched up. It's, going to, it's not even going to be able to sit in the stand itself here. There's just not enough room under the tablet to have a cable or do anything like that. That's something I'd like to see in an updated version of this product, though. Now I'm going to take a closer look at the Arrowhead stand here. We'll set one aside. Um, on the, the sides here, you can see that it's just a plastic finish. On the top, you've got a matte finish with the G, so the Griffin logo, just indented there. Um, on the bottom here, it's just got some information. So it says Arrowhead stand. It gives you a phone number, uh, where the product's assembled, uh, where it's designed, and stuff like that. Uh, it's a rubber feel, rubber finish on the bottom here, so it won't slide around. It's going to stick sturdy when you've got your device sitting in there. And the other one, it's pretty much the same exact. Uh, you've got the G, so the Griffin Technology logo. And the only thing different is the you've got a logo on the bottom as well. It just says Griffin here. And one awesome feature about these stands, um, they're both magnetic on the bottom, so you can go ahead and stick them together when they're not in use, and then you can throw them in your pocket, throw them in your travel bag, or anything just like that. And it's really easy to set your tablet on there. You just slide the feet apart as um, wide as you want, and then you just go ahead and sit your iPad, your Acer tablet, your HP touchpad, just anything. You can sit it right on the stand, and you'll be able to use it just like that. And if you really like this stand and you've got an iPhone 4, an iPhone 4S, or anything like that, as you can see right here, it's actually going to work with your iPhone as well. It's not made for the iPhone or anything, but you can go ahead and sit the stand really close together, and your iPhone will fit perfectly right on it. I would definitely give this stand a solid 4 out of 5 as it's got a ton of different features as its ability to be used with a ton of different tablets. One thing I don't like about this stand is that you cannot use a syncing cable or any type of USB while it's in portrait mode for any tablet. That is about it guys. If you guys want to check out this product, click the link in the description below. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up um, right down there and hit the subscribe button right up there. That always helps me out and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.